one. Hello, welcome to our discussion for today. My name is Dorsica Davis. We are discussing who is the best female athlete of all time. Here to discuss this topic with me is Michael Buella, Carissa Daniels, and uh, Carissa, who do you think is the best female athlete? I definitely have to say Serena Williams. For one, she was the first woman to score six million dollars in prize money. So I think that says a lot. How about you, Parker? I totally agree with you. Uh, and I think it's not only her success on the field, but also her achievements off the field that make her an outstanding athlete. Because like I think about her huge endorsement deal with Nike and like all the commercials that she's been a part of for like companies such as Apple or Gatorade. And um, yeah, she's made about like fifteen to twenty million dollars every year outside of tennis. So she's really like known all over the world and I think that makes her a great athlete all over. What do you think, Dorsica? Um, well I agree that Serena is one of the greatest female athletes, but I decided to choose someone else because um, I feel like other people get overlooked when it comes to Serena. So I chose Candice Parker. Um, she's a WNBA professional player for the Los Angeles Sparks. Um, she's won many awards and she's had great careers throughout her time playing whether it was in college or now. And um, she also won the 2008 female Best Female Athlete of the Year. So I thought it was pretty, pretty good as well. And she was also the second woman to dunk um, after she was drafted in, in the WNBA in 2008, and she was also the first draft pick. So I think she's a great overall athlete to choose as far as being one of the best as well. So I think that's yeah really great because there are a lot of uh, great athletes, great female athletes all over the world. But it's just I feel like it's easier for Serena Williams, who plays an individual sport, to stand out. And like the WNBA is not as much as much watched all over the world than it's just watched in the US, so they don't get as much attention, I feel like. So yeah. Well, I mean what she did play as a team at one point, her and her sister, and um, they actually were the first team to win three record three doubles gold in the Olympics and they did that together. But she left and recently in twenty twelve and twenty fourteen, um, she was the oldest player to have We have to say she's been in the business for already 20 years and she's been successful all over so I I guess we can all agree that there are great athletes all over but Serena is just stand out and she's well known all over and I guess we're running out of time so we might have to wrap up here thank you all for watching